The American president says it strikes the right balance between privacy and security, but critics say it's a frightening case of Big Brother watching over them. It's a secret surveillance program called PRISM that for years has monitored the phone and internet activity of millions of Americans. Today, the president tried to reassure people the government isn't listening in on their phone calls. But as Eric Sorensen reports, for a president who promised transparency, this is a major blow. It's a wake-up moment for Americans who've ever worried that phone calls and emails are secretly monitored. And for a second day, the National Security Agency and its secret intelligence gathering has been outed. In the latest, the servers of the biggest Internet companies in the world are being mined by the NSA without their knowledge for information on foreigners. This follows news the NSA is also collecting the phone records of millions of Americans. Here's how. The phone company logs the location of a caller, the location of the recipient, the time of the call, and the duration. It does that for millions of calls and then hands over all that data to the government under a secret court order. The sheer breadth of information should uh, be chilling to any American concerned with privacy. But post 9-11, government surveillance laws have been authorized and reauthorized by Congress. Everyone should just calm down and understand this isn't anything that is brand new. Still, the public's awareness of the scope of the program is brand new. To do it without our knowledge and for no apparent reason. That's scary. Everything. I don't, I don't like that. These monitoring programs began under President Bush. The surprise for some is how they've been embraced by President Obama. Nobody is listening to your telephone calls. Today, Obama defended government monitoring that he says keeps Americans safe. By sifting through this so-called metadata, they may identify potential leads with respect to folks who might engage in terrorism. Years ago, Obama railed against government intrusion. And if someone wants to know why their own government has decided to go on a fishing expedition through every personal record or private document. This analyst says, like all presidents, Obama put security first. It's somewhat stunning uh, in the sense that it is not the guy who ran against uh, the Bush administration. Obama says he welcomes more debate on Americans' privacy. But here's a clue to where things are headed. This is the NSA's massive new data center opening in October. It'll take in five trillion gigabytes of information. Eric Sorensen, Global News, Washington.